Welcome back heroes to some more Pokemon Darkrai The Legend of Giratina. Last episode we made our way to Alterian City where we did a bunch of side quests which had us run back to Professor Rowan in 8 minutes and get back to the Pokemon in time which was very stressful. <laughs> we had to find some mushrooms for a dude to make a potion so we can walk again. We spoke to some old man who invited us to his home and we had to have a dream about going to the Torn World. However that was a Team Rocket grunt. Managed to defeat them, they got away though, and we found a Pokeball, which we returned to the Pokemon, got plus 10 Karma, and then Nurse Joy gave us a, uh, a shiny Oddish, which was really nice. Looks really cool. I did a little bit of grinding, not too much, just because I had to switch train, because training Oddish is really difficult right now, and I didn't want to get Pichu super overleveled for this gym. We also rescued the gym leader from Jesse and James in Purity Forest, and now she's returned to the gym, we can go and take her on and get our first gym badge, which we're going to do right now. I'm hoping it isn't too easy or too difficult. I hope it's just like, just perfect. Oh, don't want to do that. And it looks like it's the same gym puzzle as um, Bugsy's gym in Heart Gold Cell Silver, which I have not done in a very long time. Uh, left? Oh, I can't go left because of the, the blue. Okay, so we'll go right. And then we flip the switch and then maybe we can go to the left. Welcome trainer, I'm presuming this is the uh, first gym you've crossed? Well let's show me if you're worthy to battle against uh, Jacina. I think I am. I love that sprite when you sit on the floor, it looks super cute. Level 18! Yeah I am super under leveled. Oh man, there I was thinking level 16, I'm probably a little bit over leveled but... No we are. <laughs> we are definitely definitely under leveled. Right, so I'm going to do a lot of switch training, I mean Oddish isn't going to do much against the gym leader. I'm thinking because all the bugs but if they if she does have a combi combi's part flying isn't it so hopefully Pichu can do some stuff we'll see though it's actually um kind of scary this gym hoping we can can do all right so let's go left I want to hit that blue thing so yep and then this time, hopefully we can go left. Nice. Can we hit that? Not sure if we want to. Oh no, yeah, we definitely don't want to hit that then. Wasn't sure if we did that or not. And then we go up here, and then we go right, and then left, and then we back to where we want to be. Yo, battle me. Well done. Not every rookie trainer comes this far, but your road ends here. My bug problem will beat you. Uh, you got a good chance of beating me. I'm going to be completely honest here, dude. I'm a little bit scared of you. Because you're level 18. But to be fair, our Pichu is actually kind of killing it. Our Pichu is actually pretty good. And after this battle, we should get Pichu to 17 and Oddish to... Oh, nice. Oddish to 14. Good. Poison powder. Ooh, key dokey then. That's actually pretty nice. If I have to stall with poison, I will. <laughs> we have a cheap way to win, but hey, it's got to be done. Right, so we want to go left. And then we go up. And up. Yo. So, wow. It's been a while that we uh, battled against the trainer. Oh, spinner rack and ladybug will beat you. Uh, level 19, I'm a little bit scared, but let's go for this. I'm gonna actually, once I solve this puzzle, I'm gonna leave and go and uh, heal up. Just so we can go in against Jacina fully healthy, because Peach is obviously paralyzed and very weak right now. Oh no, come on. Now's the time not to get paralyzed, you know, we want to win this battle and... Been alright, gone. Got the levy bar now. Ooh, just living. And poison will finish it off. Ooh, that was, that was close. That was super close. All right, I think there might be one more trainer which we will uh, take on. Hey, let's go. Hehe, <laughs> another trainer to wipe out. My bug Pokemon have never lost a battle. Meant to heal up first, my bad. Do that now. Thumbs four, that's 
fine. Uh, can I poison powder you? Thunder shock. As long as we can get a thunder shock off, we should be fine. And it's not looking great so far because we keep hurting ourselves in confusion. Oh my goodness! There you go. Just one more thunder shock, and you're gonna potion up. Okie dokie. One more thunder shock, dude. We hurt ourselves like four times in a row. Paralyzed. Snap that confusion. Paralyzed again. Confused again. Hurt ourselves again. There we go. Oh my goodness, that was that was just frustrating. Right, so I'm going to go and heal up. I'll see you guys at the gym leader in a second. Alright, we're back. Let's take her on. Hopefully we can do this. Oh, hello. Welcome at the Octinian City Gym. My name is Jacina. I prefer to battle with bug Pokemon because they've got some unique abilities. I think you came all this way for a gym battle, yeah? Well, let's give this a try. If you win, you'll receive the shiny Lokito badge. For a split second, I thought she was going to say like a shiny Lotad. I was like, oh, okay, but nope. <laughs> Alright, show me your skills. I said, like a shiny, lo shiny load had, I would not mind at all. But hopefully we can beat you at Metapod. Okay, so far, level 23! Right. Pardon, okie dokie. And you got Shed Skin. Cool, so happy, and wow. That was some serious damage. Gonna go for a potion, that's fine. One more Thunder Shock. Okay, no, two more Thunder Shocks. This is a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. I mean, you still have one more Pokemon left, which is a combi, which is probably a bit of like 23 or above. 23, okay. Please, Thunder Shock, do a lot of damage. Oh my god. There I was, worried about the levels, and yeah. Didn't even matter. Did not even matter a little bit. <laughs> Done it. Well, congratulations on winning your first badge. Thank you. Well done, Voltsy. I never thought you had had that in you. Well, like I promised, here is the uh, Lokito badge. So, besides the badge, I got something that might be useful in your journey. Alrighty, TM09 Bullet Seed, which I'll teach to um to Oddish. Can be good. Well, take care and good luck on your journey. You could visit. Uh, Ithaca, Ithaca City, all you need to do is follow Route 602. It's below Altinian City. Please return when you've beaten the Pokemon Champion League so I can get a chance, or I guess a chance to improve my Pokemon for a rebattle. Okie dokie. Uh, right. Let's uh, teach Bullet Seed. Make it a little bit better. Lead off with Oddish, so we can train up a little bit. I think we get a Gloom at level 22 or 23, right? Can't remember what level Oddish evolves. But I'm definitely going to make it a Vile Plume. So let's head south to Route 602, and maybe we can find a new Pokemon to capture. Ooh. Do not want to hop it, but Bullet Seed. Uh, actually, I'm going to run away because you're going to be a pain in the butt to actually beat with the music here. Not bad. Just need Cut to go that way and we just found a Awakening. Nice. We don't have Cut yet. Uh, Nidoran. No thanks. Oh, what's this? Tomb of Kalaba. Hi, trainer. Did you ever heard of the ruined tomb Kalaba? Since they discovered this tomb, strange and magnificent stories were told. If I'm not mistaken, the last person who walked in said he saw alphabetical Pokemon. Everybody laughed at him because of this ridiculous story. After since people often claim that they saw this Pokemon appear. After some resources, I discovered that this Pokemon could be called unknown. Uh, might the following question can scare you a bit, but would you like to enter this ruin? Yeah, sure. Explore mysterious tomb Kalaba. Hehe, <laughs> great to hear that. Love that attitude. Why does he seem a bit evil now? Please follow me. I swear, if there's another Team Rocket person like in disguise. Oh, darn it. How rude of me. Let me introduce myself. Uh, my name is Morris. Okay, Morris. Don't like the fact he let me go in first. A bit. No, a bit suspicious. We don't have Flash. Can you brighten up in here? Welcome to the tomb of Kalaba. Might seem scary, but that's only your imagination. Might be useful if you explore this tomb a bit more. Oh, go. Is that? Yeah, I think it's 
the hidden puzzle from Kalaba. History books have told that once this puzzle has been sold, a secret path will be revealed. Focus on the tap the table and give it a try. Uh Okie dokie. Oh, I haven't done one of these in ages. I kinda like these. Right, uh, how do I Ah, like that. So let's do the can they rotate? I don't think they can. If they don't rotate, then this is gonna be a bit easier. So that would be bottom right. That would be top right. Okay, I, oh no, oh no. I was just making sure I couldn't rotate them. Right, uh, my bad, I should do this again real quick. Right, so, and that would be there. Let's do the side bits first. I feel like that, no. Maybe they do rotate. I don't actually know. Oh, that's gonna be annoying. See the the way it's supposed to go. At the same time, I keep thinking like it's gotta surely. Kind of see the spiral going, but I don't think it's entirely correct. No, that's definitely not. I think that definitely goes like that. I think that's got to be like this. Yeah, it's definitely like that. Uh, I must have one part wrong. Hey, done it, there you go. Oh, I can't believe this, you solved the mystery. That's, how that's supposed to be, oh. Oh no, Tomb of Kalaba is collapsing. Save yourself. Oh, you and Morris both fell through the rotten floor. Oh, where, where are we? Seems like we've fallen down and been the first ones to discover this path in ages. Here, you need this now more than ever. Oh, so you get flash. Uh. Oh, I don't want to teach someone Flash, but I think I have to. Could you please be so kind to explore this part of the hidden tomb? I don't own any Pokemon, so it wouldn't be smart if I'd run around and explore this area. Right? Good luck. Yeah, great. <laughs> uh, Alright, Oddish can learn Flash. Got to be Oddish for now. Right. Hey. Ooh, little ghosts, which I'm guessing we can't. Yeah, just got to run away. Can't do anything with the ghosts, the spooky ghosts. Ooh, what's that? Look, looks like a map, maybe? Or wasn't the, uh, the quest we got, like, chart or something? So many ghosts. Found the old chart, take the chart back to Morris. Okay, I'm gonna pop a repel as well. Because we can't, you know, fight these ghosts and it does not matter. The ghosts will keep appearing. <laughs> Out of here as fast as we can. Oh, dead end. No, go away, ghosts. Come on, dude. Almost back to Morris. It's like every other step. There we go. Did you find the old uh, chart yet? I did. Can't believe you found this ancient map. Now it's my turn to help. I'll reveal the secret codes that have been written down. Okay, so unbelievable. This chart says that once you've found the purple crystal of faith, you're able to capture wild unknown. It should be located at the ground floor. 
Have you got enough information, trainer? Good luck. Okie dokie. So once we get the crystal, we can these Pokemon will be unknown, I'm guessing, and I don't really want an unknown for the team. I'm being completely honest. Never really liked unknown. But uh, if I had to capture one for the quest, I definitely will. Like I love the side quests in this game, it's really interesting. There is the stone. Right, so we got that. Gotta go back to Morris again. And now we can see unknown, and now hopefully repels work? Nope. Repels don't work in here. That sucks. D. J. <laughs> DJ. DJ unknown. <laughs> oh man, it's kind of funny. All right, yo, did you uh, find the purple crystal yet? I did. Well done, trainer. Here, take this refund for all your help. Uh, okay. I don't know what that was, but 20 something, but also I think this crystal is better off with you. Lose your Pokemon, Pokemon trainer. I'll make a rope. This will be done in a few minutes, so please stay around and explore a bit more if you wish. Right, so I want to go check this place over here. Just because I want to see what we can do with it. Probably nothing, but just because I did the check. Best not to remove this. We can't go that way. So now I just go back to Morris, I assume, and then the rope will be made and we can climb out. I think I can create a escape rope with zero seconds. I'm not good. You should be less worried and capture some unknown within the meantime. Okay, so it's literally like time based, so I just gotta mess around. So if I just like super speed up a little bit, uh, let's go pull the seed. Is it a good place to grind here? I don't think we get enough XP to be honest. Okie dokie. <laughs> uh, maybe we'll capture an unknown. What's a cool unknown to capture? X is pretty cool. Oh, train token. Oh, oh sorry, not train token. Try on token. Fraud for completing missions. Those can be turned in at Etika City. Okay. Nice. It's good to know. Uh, it's got a Pokeball. Oh, okay. Got an unknown. Maybe now. I don't know, it's been long enough. Alright, you should use the rope first. Simply follow the light and you'll find your way outside. I wish you luck. I'll stay here and destroy rope. I wish not to be disturbed. Wait, what? Okay. <laughs> right. That was, um... That was weird. <laughs> well, I think I'm going to end this part right here. The next episode, we're going to make our way to... Itaka City? I, it I can't pronounce that's my word, man. I'm gonna go to that city next, and we should find light there, because that's where we headed after we beat him on the first episode. So we'll do that, and then we'll like trade in these Tryon tokens for something, maybe. We'll see what we can get. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Peace.